Hello, welcome. We're going to today track crypto prices. Uh, why would you want to track the crypto price? Well, we might want to track the price day over day, week over week. Uh, we may use charts and um, kinds of formulas maybe on other platforms, but we also might not want to pay for access to those. We might want to build this ourselves in Google Sheets. We can actually show little uh, spark lines or little graphs of up and down. Maybe you want to set a price of your uh, product or service in crypto and you want to know the USD price or you want to know how many Bitcoin per crypto. So you want to do a quick calculation um, and we can quickly get the crypto price of three crypto currencies. Bitcoin, Bitcoin Cash, and Ethereum. You can do this all in Google Sheets. And maybe you want to calculate your investments. As you gain investments over time, you might increase your count of how many you have um, from 1.1 1 .1 to 1.3 to 2.3.4. You want to know what is the actual net value. Um, as you can see, I have it here. And how we're going to do that is we're going to use Google Finance. Google Finance is usually meant for... Um, uh, you can do currencies, but you can also do stocks. So you can put like NASDAQ colon Goog, G-O-O-G, and find the price of Google. Actually, we can do that right now. Uh, Google Finance. Google Translate, Google Finance. And we can do NASDAQ, is the, where it's traded, comma, Goog, or colon Goog. And now we can find out what the price of Google is. 1,216 today on it's April 12th, uh, 22nd, 2020. And so very similar, we can find a, uh, a currency. So IDR, I'm in uh, Indonesia right now, IDR, USD. We don't need uh, the colon for um, currencies. And it'll come out. Oh, we can also switch this. So that's IDR to USD. So you, one US dollar to IDR is... 15,590. And so the same can be said about Bitcoin. And this is what you need. You need USD, BTC, or BCH, or ETH. And you can flip them both ways. You can say USD, BTC. There you go. That's one US dollar to BTC. So one BTC to USD is 6,857. And then you can use this. Uh, Google Finance in calculations, such as this. Here, I'll show you how this goes. So I'm using the cell in D6, multiplying it by Google Finance, BTC, USD. Make sure you have the quotation marks there. And now you can find out, okay, if I have, you know, 3.45 Bitcoin, I have that amount. You can even change this format as currency, and you can get that in currency. Uh, if you wish. And that's how you can track crypto prices in Google Sheets. If you want to learn how to take this kind of data, track it month over month, week over week, day over day, add in progress bars, maybe you're trying to save up a Bitcoin to a goal. Uh, if you want to track, uh, just see some charts next to it, I, I create nice little spark lines next to there. Um, Go ahead and check out bettersheets.co. I'm offering a lifetime access deal right now. All of the uh, videos I ever make are now available to you. I'll never charge you again. Purchase now and you can find out how to create cool dashboards if you are um, tracking something or tracking crypto prices. I'm literally working right now. If, uh, if you are watching this later, I'm literally working right now on a crypto dashboard to track your prices day over day or week over week calculate how much gains, how much losses, and put up charts next to here. Uh, so I hope you come and join me over at bettersheets.co. And there's also tons of free tutorials all the time. Thanks for watching.